Hello, and welcome to our video on anesthetic considerations in geriatric patients. As we age, our bodies go through many changes that can affect the way we respond to anesthesia and surgery. In this video, we'll discuss some of the unique challenges that older patients may face and how anesthesiologists take these factors into account when planning and administering anesthesia. Segment 1. First and foremost, it's important to remember that each patient is unique and will have their own unique set of medical conditions and health risks. However, older patients are more likely to have underlying health issues such as hypertension, heart disease, and diabetes, which can make them more vulnerable to complications during surgery. Anesthesiologists take these underlying health conditions into account when determining the best type of anesthesia for an older patient. In some cases, a general anesthesia may be the best option, while in other cases, a regional or local anesthesia may be more appropriate. It's also important to consider the patient's overall health and fitness level, as well as their mental and cognitive function, when determining the best course of action. For example, if an older patient has limited mobility or a cognitive impairment, it may be more difficult for them to tolerate certain positions during surgery, and the anesthesiologist will take this into account when positioning the patient on the operating table. Another important factor to consider is the patient's medication regimen. Older patients are more likely to be on multiple medications, and it's important for the anesthesiologist to be aware of any potential interactions between these medications and the anesthesia. In addition to these specific considerations, older patients also have a greater risk of developing delirium, which is a confusion state that can occur after surgery. Anesthesiologists take steps to minimize this risk by using the appropriate medications and techniques during surgery, and by working closely with the patient's medical team to ensure that they are comfortable and well-informed throughout the entire process. In conclusion, anesthetic considerations in geriatric patients require a specialized approach that takes into account the unique challenges that older patients may face. The anesthesiologist will work closely with the patient and the surgical team to ensure that the patient's safety and comfort is always the top priority. Segment 2. The anesthesiologist will also take into consideration any potential complications that may arise in a geriatric patient. For example, Older patients may have a higher risk of developing delirium or confusion after the procedure, as well as a higher risk of developing pneumonia or other respiratory complications. This is why it is important for the anesthesiologist to carefully monitor the patient's vital signs, such as oxygen levels and breathing, during and after the procedure. Another consideration for geriatric patients is their mobility and functional status, as well as their overall health status. Geriatric patients may have multiple chronic illnesses that may affect the anesthetic plan, such as cardiovascular disease, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, or cognitive impairment. The anesthesiologist will take into account these conditions to minimize any potential risks and ensure the best outcome possible. Additionally, the anesthesiologist will also be mindful of any potential interactions between the patient's medications and the anesthetic agents. Geriatric patients may be taking multiple medications, and it is important for the anesthesiologist to be aware of any potential interactions that may occur. Overall, the anesthesiologist will work closely with the patient and their healthcare team to tailor the anesthetic plan to meet the specific needs of the geriatric patient. This will help to ensure the safety and comfort of the patient during and after the procedure. To conclude, anesthetic considerations in geriatric patients is an important factor to take into account, as older patients may have a higher risk of complications during and after the procedure. Anesthesiologists will work closely with geriatric patients and their healthcare team to tailor the anesthetic plan to meet their specific needs and minimize any potential risks. It is important for geriatric patients and their loved ones to have a clear understanding of the anesthetic plan, as well as the potential risks and benefits, to make an informed decision about their care. Segment 3. As we age, our bodies go through a lot of changes, and these changes can have a big impact on how we respond to anesthesia. Geriatric patients are more likely to have underlying health conditions, such as heart disease, diabetes, and lung disease, which can increase the risk of complications during surgery. That's why it's important for anesthesiologists to take extra care when working with geriatric patients. The anesthesiologist will carefully review the patient's medical history and conduct a physical examination to identify any potential risks or concerns. One of the biggest concerns for geriatric patients is maintaining adequate blood pressure during the surgery. As we age, our blood vessels become less elastic, which can make it harder for the body to regulate blood pressure. This can increase the risk of complications, such as stroke or heart attack. 
To minimize this risk, the anesthesiologist will carefully monitor the patient's blood pressure throughout the surgery and will adjust the anesthesia as needed to keep blood pressure within a safe range. Another concern for geriatric patients is maintaining adequate blood flow to the brain and other vital organs. As we age, our blood vessels can become narrowed, which can make it harder for the body to pump blood to the brain and other vital organs. This can increase the risk of complications, such as stroke or heart attack. To minimize this risk, the anesthesiologist will carefully monitor the patient's blood flow throughout the surgery and will adjust the anesthesia as needed to keep blood flow within a safe range. Finally, geriatric patients are more likely to have trouble waking up from anesthesia and may require more time in the recovery room. The anesthesiologist will carefully monitor the patient's level of consciousness and will adjust the anesthesia as needed to ensure that the patient wakes up safely and comfortably. In conclusion, geriatric patients require special care and attention during the administration of anesthesia. The anesthesiologist will take extra care to minimize the risk of complications and ensure the safety and comfort of the patient throughout the surgery. Thanks for watching.